Happy New Year and welcome to our monthly market update for the Peoria area and national housing trends. I'm Justin Ball, Realtor and Director of Marketing and Research with the Jessica Ball team at Remax Traders Unlimited. Let's take a look at how things wrapped up in December in the Peoria area market data and we'll also talk about a few items for 2021 as a year in review. We had 353 new listings in December and 575 closed sales, further decreasing our availability of listings and inventory on the market and 46 days average on market for listings in Peoria with $122,000 median sales price and 787 homes uh, in inventory for sale. As we look back at the whole year of 2021, we had 7,634 homes that were sold in Peoria in 2021, which tops the 2020 total of homes sold at 6,798. In really good news, we saw the average sales price for homes in Peoria uh, go up to $154,338, which is up from the $147,380 in 2020. Our average days on market for 2021 was 49 days versus an average of 89 days in 2020. Uh, so really good market here in Peoria. We saw an 11% jump in the sales price from 2019 to 2020, and we saw another 4.7% increase from 2020 to 2021. So even with interest rates likely to rise in the this year of 2022, every month that you wait to purchase in 2022 will likely change or decrease your buying power. <clears throat> As we look at housing inventory at the national level, you can see dramatic changes across the Midwest of a decline in housing inventory and specifically about 29.3% decrease in housing inventory as we look at Illinois as a state in its entirety. And what we see and what that really means is there is low inventory of homes for sale and we only have about two months worth of inventory on the market uh, relative to sales uh, nationally. Home owner equity, as I mentioned, jumped 11% in 2020 and another 4.7% locally here in the Peoria area uh, in 2021. As we look at kind of national data, you'll see the average homeowner equity growth or value of the home was $28,000 uh, for the state of Illinois in, uh, as of the end of quarter three in 2020. Uh, to 2021. So what to expect this year in 2022 in the housing market? Uh, as I had mentioned before, uh, mortgage rates are projected to rise. And so as we look at averages of um, companies managing those mortgage rates and forecast projections, uh, we're expecting to see in quarter one, 3.3% with a slow and steady rise to an average of roughly forecasted 3.7%. Uh, by fourth quarter of 2022. And we do expect that home price acceleration has peaked. We, you know, if you look at this chart, you're seeing that we're starting with 10% uh, annual price appreciation uh, year over year as we look back uh, historically at the last few Novembers. Uh, but we really see this nice flat line as we get into uh, this time of year. And so what we're expecting to see is home price forecasts are still on the rise at a national level and um, anticipating as we average out all those forecasts about 5% uh, home price appreciation for this year of 2022. So uh, a great quote from the senior leader of research at CoreLogic, we do expect that 2022 will be another strong year for housing. Uh, albeit a little bit higher mortgage rates, we do think home sales will continue to rise and actually reach a 16 year high in 2022. And there's nothing happening right here in our local Peoria market uh, that would cause me personally to think differently. So if you are thinking about buying or selling a home in 2022, don't wait. Contact the Jessica Ball team at Remax Traders Unlimited today at 309-863-5045 or visit us online at jessicaballhomes.com.